so our buddy, Mr. Alex Tech, uh, just came out with this plugin for Resolve, and it's free, and it's like the coolest thing. It's so useful. Dang it. It's not even, it's not flashy. It's not like a great, big, amazing, fancy thing. It's just so freaking useful. Check this out. Here's how this works. Let's say I'm in Resolve 18 and I have a title here. This is just a text plus title like we'd get from the effects panel here. And I just wrote a random word. How about Tuesday? And let's say I want to animate this in. Well, there are a few things I can do. I can animate this in the edit page. I can go to the fusion page and do a bunch of keyframing, or I can use magic animate and drag this onto my title go to the effects in the inspector, and I have all these controls for how I can animate this, which I can even animate those controls, crazy. But let's say I want this to just kind of whoosh in from this side and hang for a second and fly out this way. I can open up whip control and just tick in and out, and there we go. It already is a thing and it's eased and it just looks beautiful. Let's say I want it to spin while I do that. I can just tick the in and out for spin, and there we go. It's just like, you know, making something like this happen isn't a ton of work, but it sure as heck a lot more work than ticking four boxes. My goodness. And there's a whole bunch of other stuff here. Uh, I can even change the mid animation controls so I can kind of have this pulse a little bit. So I'll just push up the pulse scale. Check this out. It comes in, it just kind of pulses like that. It gives a little bit of life. I can change that with a little bit of shake. So now we have this nicely animated title that, gosh, this would just take, I mean, even if you're really good at fusion and you know how it works, I mean, it would take a couple minutes at least to make this and you'd have to jump into the fusion page. And I mean, it's just, you'd be setting up nodes, you'd be doing all that kind of stuff, but here it's a couple tick boxes, a couple sliders. This is just insanely good work. I just, I can't even, it's insane. It's so good. If you make any kind of video, you should download Magic Animate. He has a video exploring all the aspects of this tool on his channel, goes through all the details you need, including how to download it and everything. Basically, you just click on this link, which will link to his coffee page. And here's what you do. You can type in zero and download it, but do me a favor and type in 50 here, okay? Because it's worth it. It's gonna save you that much time. And to make this somehow more freaking wholesome, all the money he gets is gonna go towards fundraising for helping people with breast cancer. I mean, what do you want? <laughs> what do you what do you want? Probably the coolest, most useful free tool that we have available in Resolve now. And if you do give any money to it, it goes to charity. And any way that we can help Alex out is a great thing anyway, because that dude's a freaking genius. Dang it. It's so it's so good. So there's a link down in the description to go and get Magic Animate. I just can't say enough with how freaking well done that is. Sometimes you get to be around people who are just freaking geniuses. And that's why I'm friends with Alex is so that I could be around a genius. Speaking of geniuses, if you want another opinion on this same tool, Patrick just released a video. Here we go. Where he says basically the same thing. We were thinking it. We were both thinking it. And now we're both saying it. It's true, all right? So go and give both of those guys a follow because they're both geniuses and I just, yeah.